Hey, hey, future coders, welcome back to another video where we're going to again focus on the EN keyword, N, where we've got Ben here at the beach with his pen. And he's going to throw the pen into the ocean or the sea, you can see here, with a series of steps. You can see down below, we've got right, up, right, up, all the way to the end. So let's see what this looks like by clicking on the green flag. Ben is going to throw the pen into the ocean. Let's go and see how this is done. So let's go ahead and click on the plus sign here to create a brand new project. Let's get rid of the first character here. And again, we're going to click on the background scene. You can choose a favorite one of yours, but I'm going to choose the beach background. Let's click on the blue tick. Next up, let's go and choose Ben. Because I've already chosen Ben, it appears at the top here. Otherwise, for you, Ben might be somewhere down here with all the other characters. Let me click on Ben, like so, and then put him in the bottom left corner. Let's add some words. Let's go EN at the top. Let's type in Ben, put his name on the left here. And now, let me go and change Ben's name away from child to B-E-N, but N Ben. Now, let's go ahead and click on the plus button here, and we're going to draw a pen. Now this one here I've already drawn, but let's go and draw a brand new one and I'll show you how it's done. Click on the paintbrush. Let's call this P-E-N, P-E-N, pen. And first up, make sure that you've got this line, the thin line chosen and the color is black. But you can make your pen any color you want. Let me choose the square where I'm going to draw a rectangle. First of all, like so. Then I'm going to draw a triangle, like that. Let's move the triangle and connect it up here. And then I'm going to draw a line. Let's draw a line across, like so. Oops, went a bit too far, so let me undo that. And let's go and draw that one again. Let's go. That one's not straight either. Let me try it a third time. There we go. That looks quite nice. Now I'm going to draw a little square up the top here like that. Let's move this in the middle here. And then I'm going to draw another straight line coming out. You might need the help of an adult and then come down like so. That's good enough. I've got my pen here. Let's go ahead and we can try to fill it if we want. You might want to pick your favorite color and fill the inside of the pen like that. Let's click on the tick button here and we've got our pen. Let's click on the ABC and label it P E N. Hit enter, and now we've got our scene set. So the first thing we want to do is let's click on the yellow block here. And the yellow block is the triggering block, as you may remember. Let's click on the this one here, start on green flag, which means when we click the green flag, start the program. Let's now move on to the motion block, this blue one. And let's say, move the pen to the right one step, and then up one step. Let's first give this a go. Hit the green flag, and then you can see the pen move right and then up. Let's go ahead and repeat this. Right, up, right, up, right, up. Let's reset this. Hit the green flag and you can see the pen is slowly moving into the ocean. 
again right up right up let's reset and test again there we go we can see that Ben has thrown the pen into the ocean and that is how it's done now in the next video coming up I'll show you how you can take this code and make it a lot more efficient basically we can make it a lot shorter by using a little trick called a loop. I'll catch you in the next video.